What's up everybody, my name is Rodney. I uh, just got my blood work done from Titan Medical. Just checking out all my levels, my hormones, making sure everything's intact. Want to look good on the inside and out. You know, because being a father of a 12 year old, you need all the energy you can get. And uh, he runs around a lot. So I got to make sure I'm in tip top shape, tip top health, always, because you know how kids are. So it's always good to maintain optimal levels and make sure everything's working at its best. So Titan Medical helps me out in everyday life, throughout my daily life, throughout work, throughout my gym, especially the gym, it gives me my energy levels, optimum. Uh, I feel good, the pumps are ridiculous, they're insane. Um, my metabolism is speeding up, still, even over 50, and everything's great. My favorite therapies are Hercules Potion, I love the Titan Complete, and I definitely love the uh, ECA stack, because that gives me energy all day, even sometimes the next day. I've been going to Titan for probably going across to 10 years now. So uh, I'm one of the uh, originals. So I love Titan Medical. They've been taking care of me for 10 years now. And as you can see, it definitely works. Uh, and I'm loving every bit of it. got most of the models laid out on the screen that we can look at. For us, obviously, athletic wear is a big thing for Titan Medical Center. Lifestyle clothing is another big thing. So bathing suits, pink, white, red, and then who, what's your name? Certain situations and scenarios, you're going to have to dress a little bit different. And that's kind of what this is all about. What's up guys, John here, and uh, this is a little bit behind the scenes. We are here at Nova 535. We've got tons of new Titan fashion gear, and athletic gear, and everything that we're gonna debut here for Titan Medical Center. We're also the title sponsor, um, presenter with Donna Crowley. Amazing job she always puts on. It's an amazing venue. If you guys are in the area, come check it out. Hopefully you guys got a ticket. If not, you're gonna see all these great behind the scenes, the fashion show, everything it takes to put one of these bad boy events together. Guys, John here behind the scenes. St. Pete Art and Fashion Week. The fashion show is here. As you guys can see, it's a little chaotic, a little crazy, but we wouldn't have it any other way. So all the girls' makeup just got done. Now we gotta put together all the outfits. I'm literally back there steaming them myself to do this, making sure everybody looks really crisp, very clean. It's gonna be really cool. You guys are gonna see a lot of different things, so I can't wait for you guys to see the final result.
I heard they checking for me, no one checking on me, so I had to go run up a check. I got the message, homie, ain't no flexing on me, my attorney gon' call and collect. Blessings on blessings for me, my successes only made them envious, they got upset. I had to put all they egos in check. I want the money, the power, respect, and I heard you know so and so, you not a threat, cause I really know so and so, they like my family, so they go pretend that they cool till they bust at your motherfucking chest. I'm getting gutter, my flow been like butter, my check in the bank. They see the number, all of my haters feel one of two ways Really upset that they show some respect I can't even think about it, I have been up, so read about it No beat around it, straight to it, no ring around it You coming for me, we'll see about it We'll never see it when I get my feet up, a hundred meters Alright guys, officially at the venue, 535 Nova Got the tight medical Lambo here on full effect We're about to go inside right now because we're gonna have to go on here And start rocking the wrong way and get our girls situated so I want you guys to come, enjoy the show, see all the great things we got and all the Titan fashion because we're tight and strong and living the tight lifestyle every day. OMW, on my way to you, good at what I do, I'm OMW, OMW, on my way to you, good at what I do. OMW, watch me walk away, putting myself on display. One, two, three a day. I'm on my way, on my way. I'ma have you on tiptoes, watching my diamond after glow. I know you wanna take me home. I'm on my way, on my way. OMW, on my way to you. Good at what I do. I'm OMW, OMW, on my way to you. Good at what I do I'm O-N-W On my way, on my way They wanna judge me, I'll testify Catch me on Insta, I'm verified They want me quiet, I amplify I'm on my way, on my way To the best thing that you've ever seen You know that you bow to the queen You lose all your senses and reason I'll give you something to believe in O-N-W on my way to you, good at what I do. I'm OMW, OMW. On my way to you, good at what I do. I'm OMW. Nothing left to prove So enjoy the view Taking a picture like Malibu I'ma have you on tiptoes Watching my diamond after glow I know you wanna take me home I'm on my way, on my way OMW On my way to you Good at what I do I'm OMW OMW, on my way to you. Good at what I do. I'm OMW. Every day, baby, we're tight and strong. Feeling better, looking better, and performing better is the ultimate goal. And quality of life is the ultimate achievement. You guys want to be there, you guys need to call Titan Medical Center. 727-389-3220 and get Titan strong. Opa! Opa. That's how we do it. Hey guys, today I want to talk to you about blood testing panels and the differences, okay? Beware and be warned. There are some things out there that you might not know and you might assume, okay? Now let's talk about what we're going to get into today, which is blood panels. So here at Tight Medical Center, we offer a full male blood panel and a full female blood panel. Now you may go to somewhere else or see somewhere else and they're advertising a full panel 
or your general doctor, primary care doctor says, I'm giving you a full blood panel. And what does that mean to you? Okay, because you think, hey, listen, there's a full blood panel and there's a full blood panel. These must be the same, but really they're probably not. And let me explain why. So when we start looking at blood panels, specifically looking at each one of them, okay? So you wanna look at exactly what you're getting, the blood panels. For example, we do a CMP14, which has 14 lab tests in that one panel. We also do a CBC, which is a complete blood cell count. We do uh, progesterone, free and total testosterone, IGF-1 level. We also do a PSA for males. Uh, we have IGF-1 levels, which are growth hormone levels. We do B12 levels. That is generally the male panel, okay? And when I see full male panel advertised somewhere else, it's missing some of these tests. And these can be important tests to uncover some of the issues or problems you may be having. Or it's not checking everything that you really need to be safe to possibly go on some of these therapies or treatments, specifically testosterone replacement therapy or hormone replacement therapy. And let me give you an example. So when you're going to go on testosterone replacement therapy, most medical providers are going to want to look at a couple different things or should. Let's talk about what they are. So the first one would obviously be a CMP. So in the CMP, it's a comprehensive metabolic panel. And the main things they're really gonna look at in there are liver and kidneys, okay? And wanna make sure those functions are good. After that, I hope they're gonna do a complete blood cell count. Looking at key factors like hemoglobin, hematocrit, red blood cell count, white blood cell count, make sure there's no infection, make sure the blood is not thick already because going on an antigen, anabolic steroid like testosterone is, this can thicken the blood and cause you a lot of different health issues like stroke, DVT, blood clots. So you wanna make sure that your health is number one priority because you don't wanna be on blood thinners, okay? So that's another test. For males, a PSA, okay? And for this, they're gonna look at the prostate through the blood and make sure it's not at a higher level marker, over 4.0 usually on reference ranges. With this, you're also gonna look at free and total testosterone. Some places only look at total testosterone. That's going to do you no good, and let me tell you why. Because if you take a free and total testosterone test, you're looking at the total, which is your reservoir, and you're looking at what's pulling from that reservoir. Okay, you're free, what's getting utilized in the body. If you're only looking at a total testosterone, it could be a good level. And they say, oh, well, you're at a good level. You know, there must be something else wrong. Well, it could be your free testosterone that needs to be fixed. They should also know where your free testosterone is because sometimes I see totals very low, the medical staff does, and at that point they have a great free testosterone. So these are different things that you're gonna to wanna to look at in there. Now these are just some of the tests that they should be covering with your blood panel to make sure that you're good and safe and ready to go properly on hormone replacement therapy or testosterone replacement therapy, okay? And make sure it's apples to apples testing. Just because a price looks better than one doesn't mean you're getting the exact same thing. So really do your research, get the education, know what you're looking at before you go with a blood panel. Now, if you need a blood panel set up, we service nationwide. And I guarantee we have the lowest price out there that you can possibly find with the most comprehensive panels available. And we offer a lot more than I listed, but I could just keep going on and on and on of what those panels are. So if you want to get a blood panel done by Titan Medical Center and we service nationwide with this, all you have to do is call or text 727-389-3220 and you can sign up for a Titan Medical Center full blood panel that I guarantee is gonna have more tests than anybody out there for the price, apples to apples, okay? That's a guarantee from me, John, from Titan. So I hope you guys have got some good information from this. Do your research, get the education, and after that, if you want help, we're here to help you at Titan Medical Center. I'm John from Titan. I appreciate you guys tuning in. Thanks.
What's up, guys? John here. I'm Sharice. And we are back with another Cupid's Corner. Awesome, good information that you guys can utilize. Honestly, whatever doesn't break you will make you stronger. That is the truth. Every week, if you don't know, we come up with these tips and tricks to help you guys enhance your relationships. I hope they all see this episode. Whether it's reigniting that passion or just developing a better, stronger relationship. We went through a lot of these trials and tribulations, so we wanted to give you guys the shortcut. I mean, you guys might even do this and not realize it, and your partner might be currently upset at you, so we might help you in that aspect. This is true. <laughs> so, we're going to... What's up, guys? John here. I'm Sharice. And we're back with another Cupid's Corner. That's right. Another Sunday edition for you guys coming straight at you. ABC, 11 a.m. every Sunday. If you guys miss us, don't worry. We got your back. You can always check us out on YouTube and check out our social medias as well. Just look up Type Medical Center. So uh, this week, uh, going to get into something that we usually, I guess, never talk about. And uh, this is a tip, trick, and something that's going to help you out in life, hopefully. This is a recent thing that we, like, you know... I guess this is recent where we kind of discover like it's what it's mainstream, called. Mainstream, what, what it's, it's called. called. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we've been doing this for a long time, right? Most of us. And, and not saying it as the way that they say it today. But let's go over it. So we always get the question, what's the secret, right? What's the secret to your good relationship? What's the secret to success? What's the secret of life? And, uh, <laughs> you know, there's a lot of answers to that, depending on who you are. Oh, that's funny. And, you know, for us, uh, you know, I guess the secret, and there's a movie on this now, like a book, you know, all these different things is, uh, you know, it's basically putting the thoughts out there or asking um, and having something manifest in the way that you want it to, right? So when we talk about this, for example, it's, listen, I, I wish I had a Lamborghini. Mm -mm. I'm going to get a Lamborghini. I'm going to get a Lamborghini. I'm telling myself every day. I visualize it. I see it. I put myself in it. And boom, it's given to me. It's out there. It's, it's right? Somebody just shows up one day and drops it off at your house. <laughs> <laughs> well, they actually did. So. <laughs> well, it, yeah, it, right? actually, that really did so happen. It did. Okay, it manifested okay. into it. And that's yeah. exactly what happened, what she said. However, And that okay. can happen to you. Wait. Wait, wait. Oh uh, I know. I always got a rant on his parade. I'm sorry. But, you know, on the flip side to this, before we get into the juicy details of all this positivity, yeah. right? Yeah. We got to tell you guys the yeah. other side, right? On the negative Nancy side. So that's fine. But, you know, when, when it comes to this manifestation, right? There's only so much you can truly manifest, right? You can't, let's go back to the relationship portion of this, right? Mm -hmm. You cannot manifest to have this amazing relationship. However, you'll never listen to your significant other and think that you're gonna have this great relationship and you're gonna wake up every day and say, oh, we're gonna have the best relationship ever. And you know, you don't listen to the problems. Mm -hmm. You're not, you're not, you know, it's you're not doing your part to get the manifestation going, mm -hmm. you know, so things don't just happen either, you know, you, but you want, you know, you that's want, up for debate. You, you, listen, you don't want to just let things, you know, put bad things out in the air. Cause I mean, I'll give you an example, right? Let's say you, let's just use a very general example. Let's just say that you lie to your boss, right? Yep. And you tell your boss, your kid's sick yep. and you can't make it in that day. Cause your kid's sick. Right. But you lied. Okay. Um, kid's fine, but you know, you go to the water park, you have a great old time with your boyfriend or whatever it is you're doing. And, uh, you know, a week later, all of a sudden, your kid is sick. Yeah. So you manifested it. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. So there's a negative portion of this manifestation, too. You know, waking up in a bad mood or whatever it might so, be. Yeah, so and then there's the positive side. Well, there's a belief of laws of attraction that these things can change your life, right? So, mm -hmm. you know, you put out there positive thoughts every day i'm gonna accomplish this i'm going to do it i'm going to fall through whatever it is and if you keep telling yourself this you and you keep on track with what you're doing you're going to accomplish it right um and that goes for negative thoughts as well if you keep thinking negative thoughts you keep putting out negative thoughts you keep saying negative thoughts it's probably going to come back to you right and it's kinda um, like comes back around it's it, really weird. it really is and that's that's what it is i mean and this manifesting or this asking, right, has been done for hundreds, if not thousands, of years. And what I do is I call it praying. 
So every yeah. day I pray to God and I ask for these different things for, you know, for my family to be healthy, for my business to be successful. I talk about all the different things that I'm grateful for. Um, you know, letting me be a better person. Let me make the right decisions. Letting my son be a better man than me. You know, these are just some of the things that I ask for daily. It doesn't matter. Every day I do this. And, you know, I, obviously you know, I've been doing this my whole life and good things have normally generally happened. And I've definitely had those those negative thoughts and, and said negative things, and negative things have happened. So it's really weird how this works. <laughs> so, you know, I, I tried to... We saw this documentary. Seen the documentary. And you know, it was like, it whoa. You know, I, I guess it all kind of made sense yeah. at that point. I was yeah. like, I guess this is like a real thing. Yeah. So, I mean, it really is. And it, listen, to, to Teresa's point before, now listen, if you wake up every day and you tell yourself, I'm going to have a great relationship, and then you tell yourself, I'm going to do this, this, and this, and then you fall through with it, then you're going to have a better relationship. Mm -hmm. So there are things that you can do to make these things come to you faster. Um, that's by being proactive, right? Mm -hmm. You can't just sit back and Well, think, that was my point. You know, yeah, like that's like you waking up yeah. every day saying that you want this Lamborghini, right? right? But I'm going to sit here on this couch and watch a few, you know, TV yeah. shows. Yeah. And, you know, maybe I'll take a shower around three <laughs> and then figure out what I'm going to do with the rest of my day. Yeah. I don't know if that Lamborghini is going to show up, yeah. you know, because you're not doing the things you should be doing to get where you need to be. It's so, true. you know, it's not, you, things don't just happen either. You know, you're going to, you're going to need to want it. Right. I'm just talking to Peter about this last night, but you need, if you want it, go get it and you need to try for it. Right. You know, you're going to have to reach for it. And if you do reach for it, you try for it, usually you'll get it. But you definitely should be asking for these things daily of what you want. Positive things. Talking about how grateful you are for the things that you already have um, and then moving from there, right? I mean, this is the secret. So if anybody asks you, like, what the secret is, <laughs> this is the secret. Like, you know, always being positive. You said, like, listen, I can't do this. You keep telling me I can't do this. You're probably not going to do it because you're not going to give yourself effort and in your mind, you've already failed. You cannot think like that. You can't live life like that. That's just not the way to do it, I'm telling you. And if you do, you're going to be really negative your whole life. Negative Nancy, right? You don't want to be that person. You know what? Don't really tell him, and he's you know, listening. But John is my secret. <laughs> <laughs> he's made me a better person. Aww. Yeah, really. Thank you. I appreciate when I that. when I first met John, you know, I can't say I was the most positive positive person. To this day, I still can't say I'm the most positive person. However, when I do become negative, Nancy, or I start seeing negative things, he's usually the one to be the one to be like, "Hey, look at it this way," yeah. or "Hey." Why don't you do it this way? Or, hey, let's think about it like this. You know, so there's different spins that you can kind of, you know, maybe you could be your significant other's secret. You guys should be both each other's secret. That's how it should be. Eh. Uh, it is what it is. I'm a secret just in different ways. Everybody has bad days, <laughs> and that's how you guys got to balance off each other. This yeah. is another thing, right? If your partner's feeling down. Don't have two bad days. There's, a, there's bad things going on, whatever it is. You need to support them, lift them up. Um, that's, that's just another part of it. But... You know, like I said, there's different things you could call it as far as that goes, manifesting, praying, uh, but law of attraction is out there. That's real. It really is. And that's with people, that's with things. Um, so at that point, like, you know, I mean, I don't know, I've, I've had weird, weird circumstances in my life where, you know, I laser focus on things, said I was going to meet this person or do these things. And it's happened, right? And I kept telling myself, I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it. And put the, you know, put the footsteps forward to, to do it. Not just sit back, like Sharice is saying, like playing video games all day. And be like, yup, oh, I'm going to be a billionaire. Somebody's going to just sponsor me. <laughs> uh, Amazon's going to hook me up. I'm going to have Twitch accounts. Yeah, the I, Twitch. I was going to say, it started with a T, but it wasn't TikTok. Yeah, so, yeah. you know, like I said, you just got to ask for these things uh, and want them and actually put the effort forth to get them. And that's with your relationship too. So with your relationship, because this is Cupid's Corner, you guys <laughs> should want to have a better relationship. And at that point, asking every day for your relationship to be better, right? Or thinking every day that yep. you do have a good relationship. Absolutely. Because you want to be grateful. You don't always want to just ask, right. right? You can't just always ask the no, world. No, you got to be grateful. Or you can't always just ask yeah. God or whoever, you know, whoever you believe in or whatever you believe in. You can't always just keep asking and asking and asking. You have, you, on the flip side, you need to be grateful Absolutely. for the things that you have and the things that you're blessed with, right? Absolutely. So you got to be grateful for those things too. 100%. You know? 100%. So, I mean, that's just another tip and trick for me and Sharice, right? Yeah, tip. Um, you know, with that, like, uh, want to give a big shout out to Ed Bojacki out there. So Ed. we have a whole bunch of people that are always like DVR the shows, guys. So if you DVR the That's show, so you watch cool. the show live, thank you guys for your support. We love you guys. Yeah, and thank cool. you for letting us know. So Ed Bojacki, owner of Gold's Gym, 
Pinellas and Tampa. Big shout out to him. He watched our show every week. I know he gets these awesome love tips. I know he has to incorporate with his yeah, girl. Yeah, I know you're so, incorporating. Big shout out. And, uh, <laughs> And he brought me these uh, these awesome quick bars. Yeah, John likes them actually. I actually like these. I really don't like these protein bars and it's too much sugar and all that, but they're actually pretty good. So big shout out to Ebo Jack. We appreciate <laughs> you. Keep his corner shout out. But uh, you know, so every week we're gonna bring you guys these tips and tricks. But learn about the secret if you don't know about it. Yeah, like Google it or watch the documentary. I mean, I don't simple. really care for books, just yeah. me personally. So the documentary worked out great for me. Yeah. But it was good. I mean, it's just it kind of gave me a different look on things. But like I said, my little twist on it, because I do believe I manifest things without even trying to manifest Absolutely. it. I'm not realizing I'm manifesting. Yeah. Um, but Even uh, thoughts. Even thoughts. Yeah, even thoughts. You don't want those negative thoughts out you there. You don't in the air. realize you're doing it, right? Yeah. But, you know, after watching it, I think that, you know, half of me is like, okay, yeah, I do believe in the law of attraction. Yeah. And then the other half is like, well, things don't just come to you. Yeah. Eh. I believe in God. Yes. So at that point, he does all his, he has a plan. Uh, and I'm just following it. That's what it is. Yeah. So uh, I'm in it forever. you guys find your own <laughs> secret, manifest good, positive energy, and hopefully great things will come to you in all Aww. walks of life. <laughs> so it's been another Cupid's Corner with me, my beautiful wife, Sharice. So we'll see you guys next Sunday, 11 a.m. And remember, guys, check out our YouTube type medical center just check that out type it in there subscribe hit the all notification bell so you guys can get all the great content like this and much much more and our facebook right twitter tiktok and instagram oh just search goodness. up tight medical center and you'll find all kinds of cool crazy stuff we love you guys we'll see you guys next sunday for another cupid's corner 11 a.m see you then thank you bye